your number one source for local news. News Channel 3. Hey everybody, a good Thursday morning to you, live and direct from the First Defense Doppler 3 Weather Center. I'm meteorologist Austin Onik with a mid-morning update. We'll continue again to see some possibilities of showers and thunderstorms across the Mid-South. We'll talk more about that coming up here in just a little bit. If you haven't heard just yet, we've got an area of disturbed weather across the southeastern United States coast out into the western Atlantic. This could be a problem for anybody who's going to be doing anything around Georgia or the Carolinas, even as far south as Florida into the next couple of days. So definitely want to stay tuned for more on this from News Channel 3 and, of course, from the National Hurricane Center. It's not a hurricane. It's not a tropical storm yet, but it does bear watching. So keep it tuned for more on News Channel 3. Keeping you updated on what's going on with the weather around the Mid-South, more chances of showers and thunderstorms across much of the area. Not really seeing, again, a lot of major activity across the Mid-South, but still the possibility of these showers and thunderstorms thunderstorms more numerous into the weekend. We'll be watching this again with a lot of interest, so stay tuned for more. If anything does turn severe, we'll break out and let you know more about that into, again, our severe weather coverage, like what you saw yesterday. And also, again, if you'd like to keep up to date on what's going on with weather, science, astronomy, and, of course, we'll keep you updated on the tropical weather situation, you can check out both my Facebook page at facebook.com slash Austinonic W-R-E-G. That's one word, Austinonic W-R-E-G. And if you'd like to take a look at 140 characters or less, all you have to do is drop by Twitter for more information at twitter.com slash Aonic underscore W-R-E-G-3 for more information there. If that's still not enough weather for you and you'd like to get more detailed information about what's going on, you can go to WREG.com slash weather and you can check out our local video weather blog and exclusive video weather blog. It's called Weather Overtime. We've been doing this now for just about two to three years. And if you'd like to know more about the weather situation across the Mid-South. We'd love to have you drop by and take a peek at it, so go to wreg.com slash weather and find out more. I'll have more details on your complete forecast coming up today on News Channel 3 at noon and also into the next several days. We'll see if Todd is well enough to return to the weather station into tomorrow. And, of course, I'll have your forecast throughout the rest of the week. So stay tuned for more on News Channel 3 on air and online.